Ready, go! Breaking news. Welcome to today's headlines. Miyeti Alatu Soludo don't ban movement of cattle in Anambra. Miyeti Yala to Soludo don't ban movement of cattle in Anambra. So my dear listeners, from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read today's news. The leadership of the South East Zone of Mietiala Cattle Breeders Association of Nigeria, Makban, has appealed to Governor Chukuma Soludo of a number of states not to enforce the ban on movement of cattle on food in the state, arguing that it would adversely affect their business. Despite the law banning movement of cattle on foot on roads in the state. The eight men have continued to flout the law as cows are still roaming the streets in both the urban and rural areas as well as on people's farm. Immediate past governor of the state, Willie Obiano had during his tenure centered to the cattle and other livestock open grazing prohibition and ranches establishment bill of a number of states in 2021. Although the law has not been enforced, Governor Chukuma Soludo had during a meeting with members of a number of state cattle maintenance committee at the government house, Aokal at the weekend reiterated the ban on movement of cattle on field in every part of a number of state. According to Soludo, the ban was in compliance with the 2021 antelope grazing law of the state insisting that enforcement of the law would take effect from this month. Now that we have a law banning open grazing, the law enforcement agents have been directed to implement it. Though the law has been in existence since almost one year ago, Cattle have continued to parade certain areas in the state in contravention to the law, Soludo said. He applauded members of the Anambra State Cattle Menant Committee for their dedication to duty and noted that Anambra people have largely been living in harmony with earthmen over the years. He, however, warned that the headsmen must conduct their businesses within the ambit of the extant law. But reacting to the governor's directive, the cattle breeders said that businesses would be adversely affected if the law was enforced. Rising from a meeting in Oka yesterday, the leader of the association in the Southeast Geopolitical Zone, Malam Gidado Siddiqui, pleaded with the governor to suspend the implementation of the law in the meantime to enable them to educate their members more on the provisions of the law. Siddiqui said, Majority of us, Fulanese, don't know any other business than rearing of cattle 
Some of us were born into this rearing of cattle business here in Anambra State and we have no other place to go to. The others are aware that the state governor has flagged off massive tree planting exercise in the 181 communities of the state as part of measures to control the spread of gully erosion in the state. And as law-abiding citizens, we have cautioned all our members and equally urged them to protect the trees in their various host communities. Our members will continue to remain committed to peaceful coexistence with their host communities in the state and the southeast geopolitical zone at large. We, therefore, call on, on, call on concerned stakeholders to help us beg the governor to reverse his decision on the matter. The leadership of the southeast zone of Mieti Alakatu Breeders Association of Nigeria, Makban, has appealed to Governor Chukuma Soludo of Anambra State not to enforce the ban on movement of cattle on foot in the state, arguing that it would adversely affect their business. Despite the law banning movement of cattle on foot on roads in the state, the headmen have continued to flout the law as cows are still seen roaming the street in both the urban and rural areas as well as people farms. Immediate past governor of the state, Willie Obiano, had during his tenure last center to the cattle and other livestock, open grazing prohibition and ranches establishment bill of an umbrella state in 2021 although the law has not been enforced. Governor Chukuma Soludo had, during a meeting with members of a number of state cattlemen and committee at the government house, Oka the weekend retreated the ban on movement of cattle on foot in every part of a number of states. According to Soludo, the ban was in compliance with the 2021 antelope and grazing law of the state, insisting that enforcement of the law would take effect from this month. Now that we have a law banning open grazing, the law enforcement agent of being directed to implement it. So my dear listeners, now we've come to the end.